the dreaded throat tickle. Hi, I'm Brian Pombo. Welcome back to Brian J. Pombo Live. The things you need to think about when it comes to business, and one of the things you have to think about is your own personal health. Because if your health ain't there, you won't be able to make the meetings or do whatever you need to have to get done. And uh, so you got to look after this stuff. And one of the things that seems to be around quite a bunch lately is um, these uh, dr dreaded um, colds and flus and things of that sort. They seem to have come come on really strong uh, once once uh, COVID had died down. And so this is I'm I'm uh, putting this out there in early 2023. And so this is very much a hot topic. Uh, it's not that everything that's happening right now is all that drastic. It's just, it's more of an annoyance. <laughs> it's kind of constant little tiny sicknesses coming and going. I know in my household, it's, it's just, it's insane how crazy it is. But uh, I've done pretty well. And I'll tell you, give you a couple quick tips on things to do when you start getting that little tickle in your throat. Or, or things things don't feel that hot, because um, there's ways that you could fight it off. And I don't know, and I'm not a doctor. I'm not telling you this is going to solve anything. I'm telling you the little things that I do that may not have any effect whatsoever health-wise, but in my mind, they do, so I do it, okay? One thing I do is when I feel it, uh, especially before bed, I will gargle with warm water with a lot of salt, Lots and lots of salt, as much salt as you can stand in some water, and just gargle and spit it out. Uh, if you can stand drinking a little bit of salt water, that won't harm you either. Uh, it, uh, as long as you don't drink too much of it, it you know it may, may give you digestive issues in the short run. But the only thing, you know, a little bit of salt won't kill you, and having a little bit in your throat will help kill off uh, anything that you might have back there. Another thing that I, I like to do is if you take any type of multivitamin or any type of high vitamin things, take extra, take extra of it. Um, also, I, I heard from everybody last time I had an issue. Uh, everyone said, elderberry, elderberry, elderberry. Well, I happen to happen to have a, um, a uh, vitamin that has elderberry I get from a, a friend of mine that produces them. Uh, has uh, elderberry and zinc and a whole bunch of things to help fight off and help boost your fight off bad stuff and help your immune system. So I'll take I'll take a, a extra one of those. And uh, then another thing I do is I I like looking for foods that I know will help in those areas. Anything with a lot of vitamin C or other good vitamins and enzymes. For example, we make homemade sauerkraut. Uh, which I've gotten used to eating. And so I'm going to make sure I get an extra dose of that before I go to bed today. Um, and that, those are just a few of the ideas, the little things. Not anything's foolproof. Once in a while, something catches me off guard and it takes me all the way. But uh, if you get lots of sleep and do the rest of that stuff, stay really hydrated uh, and stay away from uh, sugars and stuff that can help encourage bacteria. Uh, if you can do that, then you might be able to just beat off the little throat tickle and uh, live to fight another day. You know, wait, wait for wait for vacation and weekends to to uh, have sickness bring you down. That's all I've got. I'd love to hear your tips. What are the things you do when you start feeling a little bit under the weather? Is I, I got a little bit right now, and I'm gonna I'm gonna do everything I can to fight it off. I'll let you know if I if I lose this one, but leave a comment down below on uh, what you do to fight things off. That's all I got for today. Go check out my training on content marketing, especially if you're looking at whether it's even right for you or not. Contentmarketingquestion.com. That's all we've got. See you tomorrow. In the meantime, get out there and let the magic happen.